All right, what's going on, guys? It's Wing News here. Um, welcome back to another video. Um, so today I'm gonna be going over my aim lab routine, which it's pretty basic. All my all my stuff I do is in the training tab. So it, it's gonna be four steps, and then I'll show you guys some of the extra stuff I do if I have extra time. But basically, I've been doing this almost every day for like the past month and a half, and it's it's made a huge improvement in just my overall aim. And, and it helps uh, in game confidence as well. So, all right. So the first the first step that I usually do is strafe track. And this this is just really good just to get basically to warm you up. So you should do this first because one it helps you warm up, and two in game scenarios when you get in a box, especially with controller players and their weird movement. So I usually I usually stand still when I do this, but you can move side to side as well. So. So there's that. That wasn't that wasn't the best one, but it is what it is. So the next one I do is sphere track. This is just good for any scenario really. In box, out of box, flicking, all this stuff. Uh, people gliding in the air, people jumping over you, that kind of thing. And then on to the next one. So the first two are tracking, and then this is more of obviously this is like the basic in every single aim training grid shot. Not really much to explaining here. It just helps with all flicking, movement, everything. So I'll do a quick run through. This is actually my worst. So. Yeah, as you can see, this is my worst, my worst one that I do. I need to work on this. Okay, so the, those are the first three, and then on to this one. I would say helps the most improvement. It's gonna be the most frustrating to do at the beginning, but basically what you're gonna do is, is you're gonna have a target. Let's see here. You can watch it on this. So you'll have a target in the middle, and then you hit it and go back. Hit it, go back, and then also it'll have the first target and then the second target will appear moving and then you gotta go back to them every time this is just good and help with flicking and just reaction time and tracking it all at the same time so but yeah this this one's definitely difficult this one i'm still working on this is the size right here about fish screen weakness so that, that one's also very good if you're trying to just improve everything at once if you're if say you're on a, like a times like say you only have like 10 minutes to do it i just recommend doing that the whole time that that's probably the we get you the best improvement so those are the first four those are those are the ones that i do every day or almost every day no matter what those are those are the ones that you want to get done and then if you want to do extra stuff you go into um tasks you go down to tracking and then go down to star track and it's, it's just tracking in a star motion you'll see but th this is good for practicing shooting kids gliding and just if a kid's moving in a straight line or a kid's just running by you 50 say 50 meters from you in game or something it just helps you out
Dang, bro, we're breaking high scores right now. Let's go, boss. So, um, yeah. So there's that. There's that one. I haven't. I have obviously I'm probably gonna break that score because I've been doing the normal ones I've been doing without this. So, and then on to the last one, which is gonna be in the task thing again. You're gonna want to go down to cognition and you you want to make sure so this one's precision that's gonna be small ultimate and speed you're gonna want to do or not speed sorry ultimate okay you'll, you'll see this is decision shot ultimate this will this works your brain a lot so it basically changes colors and you got to make sure you get the same color every time down you'll lose points that was a I haven't done this one in a while either so all right guys so that is decision shot ultimate that's just good get your brain flowing so all right guys so that is my aim lab um training routine if you guys enjoyed make sure to hit like and subscribe if you haven't already i really appreciate i'm trying to hit 300 by the end of the month if that's possible hopefully i think we can do it if we really grind so this video does really well i'm thinking about um making my own training course on like the uh the training thing right here where you can people can download it and play like the playlist and stuff so hopefully this video does well and I, I'll, I'll make the one for you guys so but anyway guys thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys later peace